Hello everybody and welcome back to Splatoon with me, Robotic Lizard, where today, just this morning, we've had a new map added. So if we take a look at the news, update information, the stage selection has been expanded to include Bluefin Depot. Now there'll be even more variety in the rotation. Alright, so we want to try that out right now. So hopefully, yep, Tier 4 has it. So we're going to be doing that now. I thought I saw a ghost here, but it's just June. <laughs> All right. And the rank battle stages, skate park, and oh, this one as well. All right. All right. Let's stay fresh. Okay. So mm, I think just to get a feel from the map, we're going to go to tier four first off. Um. Actually, I feel like uh, showing off the uh, new weapon that was added the other day as well, which should be on this page here. I've been messing around with a few different weapon types and coming back to some ones that I haven't had a go at with for quite some time. And uh, just seeing how I do with them. Some of them have been alright, some have been not that great. I know that the, uh, the Jet Squelcher and its variants aren't really my thing. Also, I hit uh, 100,000 minis. So that's cool. I had to engineer a situation where I got like a certain amount. But it wasn't that difficult. <clears throat> Not difficult. So, the strange thing with this weapon, you can't hold down ZR to fire it. You have to tap, tap, tap to actually get anywhere with it. And that's all right. You can tell it's my first time playing this map, can't you? But yeah. It does uh, three shots at once every time you fire it, and uh, those are never quite enough to kill someone. No matter how many, oop, get out of the way. No matter how many damage ups you get, and I didn't see that person. Then. Maybe I should get a little bit closer to the screen so I can actually see what I'm doing. All right, let's try coming over this way because we haven't inked this path at all, really. I couldn't get up there. So, you will have seen this stage in the uh, single player, provided you've been watching that. And where did they go? Yeah, I did experiment with this, uh, like putting damage ups as the main uh, ability on all of my gear. No matter what. Oh, then, that's a uh, drop there. No matter what, you can never kill in three hits. It always caps you at 33.3 damage. So, something worth noting. You always have to land at least two shots on all of them. And. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't have tried uh, using a new weapon on a new map, because it's not going all that great. A new weapon that I'm not all that good at either. I don't know, it's not for me, definitely, but I thought I'd at least give you a look at it because it is very unique. Uh, a little bit left to be decided whether that's a good way. Personally, it's not my thing. And I didn't even see their aiming sights at me, but oh well. I'll head down this way, get that little bit there, because I can. Actually, there's a pretty big chunk there. Okay, I just lost all visibility. I'm dying way too much on this one. I can't make that jump though. I'm still yet to use or find a good spot to use my filler wheel in. So, there's that. Get out of that. Yes, I managed to kill one person with it. Yeah, it is a weird weapon. I'm not going to continue using it. Because it's not my thing. Definitely not. It's an interesting map, though. There's only 1% in it, though. <laughs> Closer than I would have imagined. Didn't really contribute much, but eh. 
second on the team. I was honestly wasn't expecting that. But I will uh, switch weapons because I really need to. Um, I've actually been having quite a good uh, time with the blasters. So the custom blaster and the rapid blaster. I think I'll use this one for two matches and then this one for another two. Because I did five in the previous episode, although they were ranked, so eh, I don't know. But I think, I don't know, I've been enjoying using the point sensors with this, to be honest. It's a, well, it's a pretty interesting weapon to use. So what this does is it fires out in a straight line and then explodes at the end. And uh, a direct hit will kill straight away, mostly. Unless they have a lot of defense, I think. But... Is that two blasters or nozzle noses or something on their team? I couldn't really tell. But yeah, as you can see, this explodes at the end of its path, so... Anyone that gets caught in that blast. Can I censor them? Can I climb up there, please? Direct hit will kill instantly, which is very nice. Oh, I'm already doing better than last game. They have haunt, but they don't realize I have cold blooded. Well, they probably do realize because they now can see me. Yeah. That's three. Nice. That really was nice though. Oh. That, uh... It's quicker than I thought it would be. Um, could have used the bubble there, but my reaction times weren't good enough for that. Didn't expect to die so soon. Because of that area. And then here, they got an ink strike here by the looks of it. There. I can couldn't get in there quick enough. The arrow spray is a tough one to go up against. Let's head through here. And over this bit. Can I throw a point sensor over there? Not quite. What if I do that? I'll be out of the way of that. There we go. Yeah, usually uh, two hits in close proximity, if you're not exactly on, will take out any opponents. Can I reach it? I can't reach it there, sadly. I've got a bomb there, or an ink mine or something. I can't go through that, because it'll be death. Pretty much. Right, after this is gone, we might be in shape for making a charge up. And so I'll try and uh, share my bubble with these guys as well, wherever they've gone. I can't see their names anyway. There's one person down here. Yeah, they've come... oh. Not what I was meaning to do. Uh... <laughs> I hope that would go better, but hopefully we can still take this back and just focus on ground coverage. And of course they have an ink mine right there, it's gonna go off right at the end. Hmm, but that top area looks makes it look like it's more to us. Yes. Just under 10%. Very nice. So we'll do one more. And I have actually been enjoying using this. As much as I was like, no, I'm not really feeling it back when I first tried it. I'm actually quite enjoying it now. Do <laughs> like a complete U-turn. The ground coverage still isn't that great though, which is why I like the, uh, the Rapid Blaster. I think you need two direct hits or 
three, I think, maybe four close hits to actually take out someone. All right, we're spawning on the other side this time. There's the uh, buildings and such over there. Look on over here. Yeah, some of the maps you can really tell which side you start on. Some of them, not so much. Right, we've got a guy over there. Oh man, it was too low. One of the points sense of them right at the end there, because I knew I was as good as dead. I took out two people with that uh, ink strike though. Very nice indeed. Nice! Everyone's just like, yeah! Yeah, happy fun time! We're doing good! Is that one of them? I hear ink. Unfortunately, I can't hear what colour it is. <laughs> uh, I don't think you hear colours. I know, I know. to do now. I'm all the way over here. To me! Come on, we can push up. Can I see someone up here? Where'd they go? Did they head down? Maybe. I've seen people do this with the, uh, the blaster. Just do a jump and a fire and dip back in straight away. Actually seems really effective. One sensor, please. Can I get them, please? Have my bubbler if needs be. And I... <laughs> well, it won't help me there. <laughs> Oops. I'm gonna jump to this guy over here. Yeah, they seem to have taken a lot of the map though. Direct hit, and I got out of the way of that in time. Which is nice. There should be enough space for me here to charge up the bubbler again. Aha! Bubble! Weren't expecting that, were you? Yes. Oh no. <laughs> oh well. I can spam nice. I mean, I didn't really spam it. It kind of gets annoying when the sound's going through the gamepad, but whatever. That was a pretty good round. I enjoyed that. <laughs> it's incredible. Alright. So, yeah, we're gonna switch to the Rapid Blaster. See how that goes? I'm getting, <laughs> we've been getting nothing but the new map. Alright, so we're after this one. Alright, and let's join another battle. See who we get. Okay, we're in. Someone with brackets around the name? Okay. Are we gonna get Bluefin Depot again? Yep. Mm -hmm. Why would it be the new map? Why wouldn't it? Why would it not be the new map? So yeah, this fire's a lot faster, but uh, you do need to more, be more on point with your shots in order to make them count in terms of uh, taking out opponents. So we'll see how this goes. I have ink mines, I forgot about that. It's not point sensors on this one, funnily enough. It's something different. Oh, that's one of... <laughs> I didn't realise that was one of them. 
I seem to be being so nonchalant about me being there. He's like, okay. <laughs> I nearly just jumped off. Would not have been ideal. Let's, let's be real here. Because they can't get up here. Or maybe they can. I thought it, it wasn't possible. Like there wasn't a wall there. Maybe there is. Maybe I'm thinking of the other side. I probably am. I think it's this bit that you, the other team can't get to. And so from here, it's possible for them to get... Well, no, there's the... Uh, the graded bridge thing over there. But that's uh, difficult to get up without uh, being spotted and taken out. Because it does leave you very open and vulnerable. Okay, they just uh, suicided to try and get me. And it didn't work. Come on. Get him. Nice. Oops. Oh, just as the bubbler came on as well. That's unfortunate. No man, look, they, pro <laughs> they probably had one as well and would have put it on as soon as this all mine. Hey, get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Nope. <laughs> what even was that? Am I gonna jump to anyone? Yeah. Oh, they were right here. I thought they... I thought their icon went further out. But, nope. Can you die, please? What? How do they have a killer wheel there? That's just mean. Go away, please. Let's just bypass all this, take them out. They're right here. There's two direct hits. Oh, and I died. 420 points! Yeah! <laughs> that wasn't a great one. I don't think we pulled it back enough. Or maybe we did. <laughs> Someone got around the back of their base and managed to do a lot of work there. 720! Alright. Not bad. We still emerged victorious. We'll do one more. Have another go. We'll just, we'll just, just be an entire D. That sentence is going nowhere grammatically. Let's just be an episode comprised entirely of Luffy and Debo. Quite possibly. Is it? It is indeed. Alright, we'll go with it. Let's try starting off with this path first. I need to use the jumpy thing more. Because all the, uh, the people who use blasters seem to do well with that. All the people I've seen using them, I should say. Take a little ink mine. Yes, walk on it, walk on it, walk on it. Oh, they died anyway. Bubble! Uh, hey! Pro, pro, pro. I'm so good. <laughs> Not to toot my own horn or anything. Aha, you do not see me! Oh, they did. They saw, <laughs> they saw me. That was so sneaky of me. But in the end, it didn't really pay off as I hoped it would. It's just a shame I didn't get anyone with the ink line. Fill in this area. It's this reason that I sometimes like using the uh, rapid blaster instead of the regular one. So I can cover area more quickly. Oh, I didn't even get time to place down the ink mine. And my, that weapon kills him like two, three hits. It's insane. That little bit there always gets pissed. Oh well. 
This seems to have had a uh, thing strike through there. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't either. Oh, the person behind me does. They do. They set down their own ink line there as well. And they're sending that thing strike right there. It's actually pretty far away. Ooh, direct hit. Nice. Oh, if I squid, I'm dead. Nice. I love getting direct hits with this. It makes a satisfying sound that you get with charges, but it's a lot more common, so it's a lot more satisfying. Right, if needs be, I can share my bubbler with these guys. Yes, there we go. Rush! Rush in! Pop that there. Is anyone taking care of the middle bit? I'll do that. They can get that area. I'll get this area. I think we did pretty well there. And I'm not sure who won, I think they did, but... Yep. It was a very close game. Regardless, I had fun with that one. Oh well. I did enjoy it anyway. I hope you enjoyed this episode as well. If you did, don't forget to do all the YouTube video -y stuff, including checking out the links in the description to my Twitter and Twitch. But, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye!